Hi guys, and welcome back. I hope you're all doing well and having a lovely day. So as has become a little bit of a tradition, I've got this guy with me to make some Christmassy videos today. And the first one, we couldn't not do our B&M stocking filler challenge. Well, this is more like a sack challenge. <laughs> I couldn't no, resist the, getting these. It's the B&M challenge, but... Yeah, but it's not a stocking, is it? Oh, well, sorry, yeah, that's what you mean, yeah, sorry. I fell in love with these when we saw them in B&M. So these are also from B&M, B&M. But they're not part of our budget. So we had a 30 pound budget. These are actually nine pounds, but I justified getting them because obviously after like nine Christmases, they work out to one pounds each. Mm. And then after 10 Christmases, they're like almost free. So mm. really good value for money. Mm. So anyway, we're gonna show each other what we picked for each other. So we did, Something you want, something you need, something to wear, something to read, and something to eat this year, didn't we? Yeah, need, read, eat, wear. <laughs> something, yeah, something like that. That's what we did. So well, let's hope I got it right. We don't know what Rick's got. No. But we'll see. What do you want to start with? Um. Well, just just to preface preface this, I know I already went over budget because the thing that I got you that you need. I didn't realise it was as expensive as it was and then when I got to the till I, I felt like really awkward to say well I want to put that back. What's the point in doing a £30 budget then? I'm just saying. Yeah. I think I'm bang on the budget. I'm like maybe 50p over. Okay, let's do it then. Okay, what do you want to go for? get some stuff off your nose. What do you want to go for first? Hang on. Ow! So you had all bits like saturated. So let's do something you want. Yeah? Something you want. After three. Yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, I was so quickly. Oh, the reason why I got you this is because you always drink gin and cocktails, and this is the perfect glass for both. You see, cranberry cosmopolitan cocktail mixer with this a vodka. Gin. No, but you can use it for a gin glass as well because right. it's basically the top of a gin glass with that yeah. whole thing. So I thought you could use it for cocktails and okay, gins, so and you haven't got to have that massive glass carrying around everywhere. So this is um, to make a Cosmo, isn't it? Yeah. A cranberry Cosmo. How much was this one? Six ninety nine. I think this was six ninety nine as well. I can't believe the thing that we both wanted is alcohol. <laughs> it's Christmas. That says a lot about us as very exhausted, tired parents. <laughs> um, so I got Ricky this. Um, is it Kraken, rum? Yeah, Kraken, the Kraken, yeah. which I know you really like. Yeah, it's lovely. And it comes with a Kraken glass. You have one of these? No, I used to. Oh. But it broke in the move, I think. Oh, that's good then. I haven't had one since. Yeah, these were £6.99 each. They do some really nice glass and alcohol sets. So. I just thought as well, because you love gin. It's but like this isn't gin, gin, babe. No, but it's like a gin glass without the handle. But it's the it's like a gin without gin. Need. Okay, let's do need. One. Wait, 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 no. I don't know what it is. <laughs> this is my this is my silliest one. Because this is the one. How is it silly if I need it? Oh god. <laughs> right, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> I suppose I do need So, the reason the thought behind this was, you always use cleaning pads to clean your face, right? Yeah. So I thought, why not get you some reusable ones? And are you, are you basically outing me on YouTube and that I'm not being eco-friendly <laughs> with my cycling. cleansing pads? And these are like the softest things I've ever felt. Yeah, they are nice. And I only had £2 left in my budget and I back £2. So you get three reusable cleaning pads for £1.99. And then machine washable. Our budgets on this item were slightly different because I got you this. How does that? That's not for me, is it? That's yes, you it telling me you. that I need to clean the windows. Yeah, you need this to clean the but windows. But you need that too. Yeah, but you need it too. So this is the Bell Ray window cleaning vac, and I think you can also clean like the sides, the car, the shower. You can do loads of cleaning with this. And this was twenty two pounds, so it wasn't really a stocking filler. But I thought I, I should get him something he actually does need. So let me just do a close up of these. Next up, something to wear. Oh, it's gonna be. Are you ready? Need, no, no, you need to give me a second to get this out because this is the big one. One, two, three. Is it backwards? Yes, backwards. <laughs> oh! So you all, you're. I'm always hot and she's always cold. So I thought instead of getting something where we have to share a blanket, 
why not just get your own blanket? And it's white and it comes with a zip oh. and it's got pockets and I it's got a hood. I like this. A super soft lady snuggle jacket. And, because I know you like things baggy, I've got it a size up. Okay. So it's cozy for the sofa. But, oh, oh, I love this material. <gasps> Can I put it on? Yeah, I think it's that way, isn't it? Ready? Ready? Oh my God. I'm living my best life. Oh, look. See, I, I wish I'd got the size up now. I was going to get the 14 to 16 size because you like things yeah, baggy. Yeah, I get that. But no, this is good because remember, I've got a jumper on. I wouldn't wear yeah, the jumper under it. But it's not for like outdoors. It. No, I know, but indoors. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I wouldn't wear a jumper under it. I'd wear like probably right. pyjamas. So it would probably be a little bit But again, baggier. it's super soft like your new pads that you're going to really use. Look. It's so nice. It's got pockets. Living my best cozy life. And that was actually Thank the most you. expensive thing. That was eighteen pounds. <laughs> it's like these. Yeah, a it's, match. It is like that. Oh, mine's not as fun, but I think usable, and that you would actually wear umbro yeah. socks. I must be the world's worst with socks. I go oh, through. And they're your size. That's always a bonus, isn't it, babe? So I always wear socks. They're nice umbro. Four pack of Umbro socks for five pounds. What are we going to do so next? So read, yeah? Read, okay, read. Ready? This one is definitely going to pull on the heartstrings too. <laughs> Ready? This is, right, so next we're doing read. One, two, three. So I got you a child. <laughs> Oh, this is not funny. I'm not laughing that he's dead. It's because on the back it's got one of his quotes to read, and where you drink so much tea, it says, I'm not great at the advice. Can I interest you in a sarcastic comment? No, you're saying that's So, and it was the last Chandler one there. So you can drink tea now whilst quoting him. But that's the whole point, so when you drink it, you can read his quote. Yeah, but that makes me sad. Yeah, but as the time goes on, you won't be sad. How much anymore. was it? I, I think it was a pound. He said a pound on the thing, but... What, was there loads of all the others in one China one? Yeah, and it's right at the back as if someone was trying to keep it, but I found it. Thank you. I do really appreciate it, but it just makes me really sad. Now I can't laugh at me. What I got you? <laughs> that was really good for read, though. Yeah. I've had a bit of a, a minute and I'm better now. I think, do you know what I think it is? I think he was like my first love, my first crush. <laughs> and I didn't actually realise that until... Until I got that cup. No, but I, I just think that's really sweet that you thought of that. I've still got this one to show oh, you. Oh yeah, sorry. So my one was meant to be funny. I got you a book, because I think I did the same thing last year, I got you a book for, to read to Finlay. Yeah. Well, actually, I think Elliot will like it, and it's called Butt Owl. All three of them are like that. Finlay's always got and Butt Owl as well. <laughs> it was £3, and it's got a squishy butt, and then you, each, obviously, animal, it shows its butt. We've got three boys, they love bums and poo and stuff, so they'll find that funny. And then I didn't get a close-up of the mug. I think that would actually be a really nice, thoughtful gift for a friend's fan this year in, the st in a stocking. Oh, anyway, right, finally. <laughs> last the one. last one. This can't be an emotional, it just can't. Something to eat. Go one, on. two, three. Oh, nice. Salted caramel Baileys. I got you Tangfa sticks. I'm That's not it. sure if they would be your favourite Harry though, actually, but I didn't really... I thought the oh, I've got original were I've gone on sweets a little bit recently. <laughs> there wasn't any really cool pick and mix or like, I really wanted to get you your blue and pink bottles. Yeah, they don't really they do that. Have them, so I just went quite boring. But oh, I went Christmasy. I went safe. I went Christmasy. Yeah, but I, see, I can't get you chocolate. You're just not into it like me. No, I don't mind it. I just can't eat low, large quantities like you do. So we got the yummy Baileys. They look delicious. They'd be nice in a hot chocolate. I wonder if they'd melt and taste of Bailey's. Oh yeah, they probably would actually. I might try that. Tongue fast sticks. I, I smashed it this year. That is everything. I won this year. 
Oh, there's no winners in this game. There is. We asked winners. last year who won. No, 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 no. Yeah. So you, you know what to do. If you want to. Pick a winner. <laughs> well, I went about eight pounds over budget, so just on that, I lost. And I stayed. Well, I think I stayed in budget. The only thing that I've got a question about is the cup, because it said a pound on the tag, but it oh, could have right. been any tag. Whatever your budget is, if it's twenty pounds, thirty, whatever, I think it's this is a really nice thing to do with your partner or someone special, um, especially like the little rhyme as well. It just makes each item a little bit more personalised, and you can talk about the reason why you got it. So that was really fun. I'm Thank going you. to go and put my new socks on whilst drinking my rum. I've still, still got this on. <laughs> you must be boiling. Ooh, I am actually, but I, I'm, I love it. I absolutely love this. I can't. Didn't realise I still had it on though. Um, it's almost like Miley, isn't it? It is like Miley. My dog matches my hoodie, matches my stockings. My life is soft bootcase fabric and I'm here for it. Okay, we're going to go now. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Please subscribe if you haven't already for lots more fun Christmassy content and leave us a comment in the description box below. Let us know what your favourite item was or who indeed you thought won. This guy, right here. Um, we'll see you soon. Bye, guys.